Frederick Meyer Gardens, Frank Lloyd Wright, Furniture City. There's a history of art and design sculpted right into Grand Rapids. The American Horse, La Grande Vitesse, that's French, by the way, for the great swiftness. And speaking of French, a French-speaking artist is the new face of new art in the city. Last fall, Abdoulaye Conde won art prize with his colorful mural, Raining Wisdom. Here's his story. To Abdoulaye Conde for his mural, Raining Wisdom. Abdoulaye, please come to the stage. The moment. The man behind the elephant mural won $125,000. As Christians, poof, my life like this. Born in Guinea, West Africa, Abdoulaye Kande moved to his country's capital as a teen to pursue a career in art. I have to work because it's only me. I told my mom I, I want to build house for you one day. Cultivating a style called Nyabasan, he made money selling custom portraits and painting murals. My message is to tell people we have to be together, we had no different, we have the same. In 2019, Kande married Anissa Shaw, who was working in Guinea with the Peace Corps. In 22, they moved to Chicago, and the artist learned about Art Prize through his in-laws. I said, yeah, of course, I want to try, yeah. That was like my dream. I say, yeah, that's my first competition. This blank white wall on Ottawa Avenue would become his canvas. But why elephants? Because elephant is smart, love his family, protect his family, love living in harmony. Beginning with the top corner, Kande worked down and across. Two coats, 25 days. Like this, step by step, that's helped me so much. And then, poof. Abdelight, please come to the stage. The winner of the Public Vote Grand Prize. He could build the house he promised his mom. It's very amazing, wonderful uh, to win a prize. I think it's a really exciting time for the uh, uh, arts and cultural scene here. The man who announced the award, executive director of Art Prize, Catlin Whittington, says Grand Rapids punches above its weight. Really make Grand Rapids in this scene more than the sum of its parts. And size might actually be an asset. A certain level of affordability and accessibility that some of the bigger markets might not have for artists. Because walk anywhere in the city. The commercial businesses downtown have a wealth of amazing art in them. And there's a chance you'll see something special on the wall. It's not traditional commercial art and, and lobby art. It's originals and it's really quality artistry. Now, as for next year's Art Prize, the 15th edition, the executive director says they're laying the groundwork and the whole city is their canvas. In studio, Sam Lanstra, Fox 17 News.